Hey everybody, it's Rod Nazari with Talk Android, and uh, here at CES 2014, we're with Elliptic Labs, and this is a concept right here um, uh, on a Galaxy S4, uh, being able to use uh, gestures to control your phone. Now, ironically, we're using uh, Galaxy S4, which did this. Uh, however, it was using the camera. This is a different situation, and now on the outside you see a box around the phone, and again, this would be something that will be installed in the phone. And there's four microphones. And you can see as I'm moving my finger around, it's picking it up. And you don't have to be directly over it. You could be to the side um, in order for it to detect. And this is just obviously a simple, um, we're scrolling through the gallery. Yes, we can actually make it move as well, everybody. And we can also look at, uh, it all depends on what the OEM manufacturers do with this. They can uh, do it so you can control your home screens, browse the, the web, and here we got Facebook we can show you. Girls, we have 10. And I have Hans here to tell us a little bit about it. When do we expect uh, to see the first phones with this, do you think? Uh, we expect to see this in the market uh, within 2014, so it's, uh, it's getting close. Here you see uh, scrolling, and you can notice that I can scroll uh, at the side of the screen. Yeah, you don't have to be directly over the phone. So I'm not blocking the view to the screen. I can go into ordinary touch mode, and I can touch as usual. Okay, you're touching the display you there. you see a kind of proximity sensing where menus pop up when I'm close to the screen. I can take my hand away and I go into scroll mode. So you could use this, uh, the OEM could use this, you could unlock your phone with this if you want, probably. Uh, go into your settings, maybe even swipe down to your notifications. Right now this is just set up for a few things. That's right, so we have released our SDK for, for Android and based on this either uh, application developers or OEMs can customize their applications. Now they need four microphones as we said. They can utilize existing microphones um, in their product but they have to be in the front of the device. They have correct? to be in the front or on the side. At least in the, and in the corner shall we say, right? They have to be separated uh, enough for the whole thing for it to work correctly, right? There should be some distance between the microphones, that's correct. But, uh, we can already use the microphones that's in the, in the device from before. So what we would do is to add one additional microphone maybe. And this is using ultrasound? It's uh, using ultrasound, so it's like an acoustic radar. Uh, we transmit ultrasonic signals, they're reflected from the hand. And we pick up the signals using ordinary men's microphones. Alright, well great. We're looking forward to this later in the year. Thank you very much. You're welcome.